Hello everybody and welcome back to another vlog. So I'm about to head to the gym. I'm gonna attempt to film some of my workout. I haven't filmed part of my workout in so long, so I'm gonna try. I hope the gym's not busy. This is kind of a random time to go, so fingers crossed it's not overly crowded, but like I'll try and get some clips. I'm not sure if it's gonna be like a full workout, but we'll see what I can film. I'm just wearing these leggings from Lululemon and then this sports bra from Lululemon and this cropped friends t-shirt. And that's my look. I'm just gonna wear some sneakers. I think I'm gonna do a little bit of running on the treadmill. It's something new I've been doing, um, which I actually am starting to enjoy. I used to hate running, but it's growing on me. So I'm gonna only do like a little bit of running, like not a lot, <laughs> but some running to warm up. And then I'm going to do some legs. Hopefully that'll make me feel good inside. So yeah, let us go and work out. I'm gonna vlog a bit of my weekend for you all. It'll be a weekend vlog what not so let's get let's get going <laughs> make sure to blow this out so you don't start any fires <laughs> fire no fire what am i saying i don't know <laughs> are my socks cute they're like checkered i always get my socks from vans if you were ever curious We're gonna get another one. Hope for the best. I don't know if my onions have gone bad. That would be tragic. That one looked weird. This one, more promising. Also, a lot smaller. So, less likely that I'm gonna ball my eyes up. There's less of it to cut up and cry about. Duh. Onions, man. Okay. But you literally just can't cook chicken without onions. Like, if you're cooking chicken without putting onion and garlic in it, what are you really doing, you know? Like, what are you really doing? That is the dryer, it sings. I need to open the door. Okay, this onion is getting cut up in a disastrous way, but it's fine. I actually haven't cried yet, which is impressive. Not gonna look. Oh my God. Oh, I feel a little bit of a tear coming on. We're gonna fight that off. No onion is making us cry today. Okay, that was actually extremely impressive that I just cut up a whole onion and I didn't cry. Um, I think I deserve an award for that. That, I am, am I a witch? A superhero, this is my superpower. I don't know, but like, whole onion, no tears. Okay, my eye is getting a little bit watery, but didn't shed a tear, bitch. That's right. Hot girl summer. <laughs> okay guys, this is my finished dinner. So I just made this chicken and then I have a salad. The chicken, I used this sauce. I'll show it to you. What sauce I used? It is the East India Company coconut sauce. 
It's like a curry sauce. I love coconut curries, so put that on it. It's really, really good. I'm gonna go inhale this and watch 13 Reasons Why for a bit before I go with my mom later. We're gonna go to HomeSense and get this beanbag chair from my office that I wanna get. I wonder why I'm eating front show right now. Yeah, that was the plan. So I'm gonna eat this right now. <laughs> I don't do that. Hello everybody, it's later now. Me and my mom are finally going to HomeSense to hopefully get my beanbag chair. If it's still there, praying that nobody has bought it because it was fluffy, so I feel like people would have been tempted to steal it. But let's just hope they didn't because I want it. So hopefully it's still there. And I can get it from my office. And it looks so cute. And I want to get like a little side table and just make it make it cute, you know? Gotta set it up. But yeah. <laughs> Praying that it's there. Please be there. Beanbag chair. That rhymed. They had the freaking beanbag chair. Success. <laughs> and I also got a side table for it. And it's so cute. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. <laughs> Good morning, everybody, and happy Friday. I wanted to show you my little setup. Um, and this morning, I'm just chilling. I'm going to go to the gym soon. Um, I need to finish drinking my coffee, which I should find in the microwave because it's probably warm now. But like, I want to show you guys my little spot. Let me just put my laptop down. It's so cute. Okay, ready? You guys are ready for how cute this is. Although I have zit cream on, so ignore that. <laughs> but like, look. Is this not the cutest little setup you've ever seen? So that's my chair that I wanted to get. It is so cute and comfortable, and I'm obsessed with it. And the little side table. So I put one of my plants on there, a candle, and then a little coaster so I can drink my coffee here. And then the plan is, what I'm actually gonna look for right now, is I wanna get like a low um, sh like shelf unit thing, but one that's like kind of lower, and then kind of put stuff like all inside of it and on top of it, and then hang all the art like above it. Just something that won't take up too much space there. I also wanna get a circle mirror to incorporate into this like thingy that I'm doing here. <laughs> I need like a circle mirror too just to like hang on the wall as well for this like gallery wall I feel like that'll look really good. So I need to look at home sense again I swear I'm always there. They take all of my money I need to get a frame for that little piece of art and I want to get a blanket like a white blanket for over here So if I'm sitting there with my coffee, I can like curl up with a blanket or like read a book I put my little book basket there too, but of course when I have like the shelf thing I can organize everything better in that area and yeah, I moved my desk to over here. I like it better over here. It's just less in the way. And I like the little mantle there with like the flowers. And I can put my like um, 100,000 plaque there. I just think it goes well together. So I just love this little corner. I think it's so cute. And of course, this is like the filming area. So the main goal is to keep the center empty for my tripod so I can film fashion videos here. And yeah, I just need to figure this out. But I'm just so happy about this. I'm so happy. I just need to microwave my coffee, I think, because it's kind of getting cold and I want to drink all of it because I need all the energy I can get today. This is my tourist mug. I honestly forget where I got it. I think maybe HomeSense. I get everything from HomeSense. So we're just gonna nuke this coffee a wee bit. Just like 20 seconds. Eh, there we go. <laughs> This is basically what I'm thinking about getting for there. So it's the Calyx shelf unit. So see how it's like the open little box kind of thing right here. I feel like that would be really, really cute and I can store like little cute stuff in it. I can take like my cameras and put them like inside the little bins, get some knickknacks. I think that would be really, really cute. So I think I'm gonna get that. I think this would be literally perfect for there. Perfect. Okay guys, I just finished up at the gym. I was literally there for over an hour. I was there for a really long time. I did a really good, really good workout. I ran on the treadmill. It's like a new thing that I'm doing. I used to literally hate running with a burning passion, but I'm starting to like it, which is weird and not like me, but I'm building up slowly because obviously I'm not a runner, so I get really exhausted. So today I just did 12 minutes at level seven, like running. Not like a jog, I run, I run. This isn't a jog, I'm running. <laughs> so yeah, I did 
12 minutes of running, which was really good. I was tired. And then I did a full upper body. So I did biceps, shoulders, triceps, and back, just everything. And then I did some abs and stretched. And that took me like over an hour. And yeah, now I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I wanna get some food for the weekend and whatnot. Even though tomorrow I'm doing other stuff with like my mom and shit, but I need to get some food because we're like running low. Anyways, I'm like rambling, but yeah. I'm gonna go get some food some food from my belly and yeah i'm dressed like a literal soccer mom in my puma hoodie sunglasses and leggings and sneakers i look like i'm gonna go pick up my son from soccer practice but uh don't have a child thank god but yeah <laughs> anyways i'm gonna go now and that's my update yay <laughs> Good morning everybody. I'm heading downtown today with my mom. We're gonna go do some shopping and go out for lunch at a vegan restaurant. I'm really, 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 really excited. The weather today is like really nice. It's sunny, but it's not that hot out. It's going up to like 20 or something. So not very warm. So I am wearing like jeans and a long sleeve top because I get cold very easily. <laughs> so this top is from Princess Polly. It's one of my favorite shirts that I own. I think it's called the rain dance top. Don't quote me, but I'm obsessed with it. And I do have a code, I'll put it on the screen. It's like love Chelsea or something like that. Or I don't know, it changes all the time, but something. I'll look at what it is. <laughs> and you guys can get 10% off Princess Polly. I think it's 10% or 15, I'm not sure. This necklace is from Majuri. All of my jewelry is from Majuri. Earrings, rings. They're one of my favorite jewelry companies. And then I'm just wearing my Levi jeans. These are like the 501 straight or something like that. They're not the wedgies, I know that, but I'm obsessed. These are my favorite Levi's that I own. I literally wear these all the time, constantly. And then these sandals are just from American Eagle. Not very supportive or anything like that, but whatever, just easy to wear. And then I'm just wearing my little straw bag. Some people ask me where I got this. I got it gifted to me when I went to Korea, so I'm not sure where the hell it's from, but I love it and I use it all the time. So thank you to the Laneige and Amore Pacific team for gifting me this bag because I literally wear it all the freaking time. And then these sunglasses that I'm wearing are just from, well, this is a good look. <laughs> They're just from Zara. And yeah, my makeup is just the huge some good old full coverage because my skin like I don't know if this is a reaction I have like little bumps like all here I honestly don't know what's going on but I'm going to see a naturopath on Tuesday so in my next vlog I will keep you guys updated on what happens with that I'm hoping well I'm gonna ask to get my blood work done so I can test all my hormone levels because I want to know if one of my hormones is off balance because maybe that's what co is causing my acne um so yeah I'm going to see the naturopath on Tuesday so fingers crossed we get some sort of stuff done to like help my skin because clearly like there's something going on and I just want to know what it is like what is missing what mineral am I lacking what hormone is off balance like something is obviously wrong inside that's causing me to have acne on my face so we're gonna figure out what the hell that is um for my lips I'm just wearing the buxom plump line in hush hush this is one of my favorite lip colors of all time. I always just kind of put this on during the day and then I carry around um, Max Velvet Teddy. It's kind of the same color. And then if I need to touch up, I just apply Velvet Teddy. It's just easier, I think, than putting, a, putting on a lip liner. And yeah, I'm just having my coffee, waiting for my mom to come get me to go to the GO station. <sighs> Yum. But yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna buy downtown today, but I'm gonna look. I wanna go to Free People. It's one of my favorite stores. Of all time i have a literal problem with how much i love free people i'm obsessed with it so we're probably gonna go there and then i'll probably just look at other stuff too i just love ball clothes i want to get a cute cardigan that's kind of what i'm looking for so i might go to ritzia and see if they have the cardigan that i want at that one but yeah my outfit and i'm ready to go i'm so excited my mom have made it downtown so first stop is that we're gonna go to the eaton center and look around and shop there for a bit um because we have a reservation for lunch at one and it's only like 11 45 11 50 right now yeah 11 50. 11 50 so we still have like a bit to kill some time so we're gonna go to the eating center look around then go to our lunch reservation and then we might go shopping on like queen street or something i don't know we're still figuring it out but yeah we kind of like our outfits are like coordinated we both look very like boho right now <laughs> but i'm here for it i like it and yeah, I'm really excited to go to the restaurant for lunch. It has really good reviews and it just looks like it's gonna be really, really good. So I'm excited. 
So we're gonna get the, I already forget what we're getting, the spring rolls, the spinach and shiitake dumplings, and then the General Lee's cauliflower to share between us. It should be pretty good, and we both just got matcha lattes too. back from downtown. Me and my mom are just at my place now, but I was gonna show you guys what I got when I went shopping. I just got four things and I love every single thing I got. <laughs> okay, so first up I got this yoga mat. I told you guys I need a new one. This one's from Lululemon. Three millimeter mat I got in this color, so it's like reversible so you can pick which side you want to use. But yeah, I just liked the color of this one. I'll probably have to use it on this side though because I have really sweaty hands. <laughs> And then from Zara, I got this bag. So this is gonna be my new purse for the fall and winter. And I am literally obsessed with it. So it has all these gold like studding on it. It opens like this. It has a little zipper pouch in the middle and then two sections. So you can kind of keep it organized. And of course it has the shoulder strap and then the handheld strap. It's just the cutest bag. And it was around, how much was it? $59.90. So it came to like $65 with tax, which I think is pretty good for a purse. I really love this one, so I'm really happy I got that. I mean, now I'm going to use that so much. Then I got two things from Ritzia. Ritzia is goddamn expensive, but like I love their stuff. So I already knew that I really wanted this cardigan, so I went ahead and got it because I keep looking at it and I love it. So this is called the Teus Teus Cardigan in Oak, and yeah, I got it. And I love it. I want to wear it with like pretty like bralettes under it with like jeans in the fall or you can wear it with like shorts right now and it's still kind of like almost fall but not really. And I just love that look. It goes with everything like plaid skirts, just everything. And then I got this sweater which I actually want to go ahead and get in another color too because I'm so obsessed with it. But I had to get it in this green because you guys know I love green. So it's really, really fuzzy. It's by Wilfred Free and it's called the Gwyneth. I got it in neon ivy and I am obsessed. It's the softest, warmest, coziest thing. And I really want it in like the brown kind of like cognac. Is that the color? Yeah, cognac color that they have it in. But I'm obsessed with this one. Very pleased. And yeah, so I'm home now. I'm going to clean a bit and then make me and my mom dinner. And then I think we're going to spend the night at my parents' house tonight and just chill there. And my mom's by herself too. The dogs aren't here or anything. So yeah. I am tired. Being downtown and walking around is exhausting. It's exhausting. It is. It's a workout. Okay, shopping is a workout. Mm -hmm. 